Hi, it's Lewis at GAK in Brighton. I'm holding the uh, Fender Custom Shop 52 Fat Telly. It's heavily relict and it's in white blonde. So the body on this is a two-piece slab of ash. So it's going to give you a slightly lighter sound than you would get from an older body. Um, it's obviously heavily relict as well, as you can see on the back and front. Um, Pickups wise, we've got a uh, Seymour Duncan Antiquity here, and we've got a Tele Relic here, 52 Tele Relic pickup. Neck wise, it's uh, maple here, and the wearing, uh, the heavily relic finish continues onto the neck, and it's non glass on the back, so it's kind of satin feeling neck. Uh, profile wise, it's got a U shape, so it's quite similar to uh, the No Caster, the early kind of Tele's 1952 and backwards kind of necks. Um, Fretboard radius wise, we've got 9.5 inch, so it's actually more modern than you'd find on an actual 52 telly. A uh, little bit flatter, not as flat as some other guitars. Yeah, this guitar's got a really good sound, and as well, the um, various processes they do to the wood gives it a nice, more mellow, softer sound, so you can dig in a bit more and you won't get that harsh, plasticky kind of high end that you sometimes get on very new guitars. So, yeah, it's got the brass saddles as well, so they really help with the sound projection. And um, an old style Fender No Caster bridge here. I really like this. It's really good for digging in and playing some heavier stuff, but it's also got that classic telly sound if you need it. So now let's hear the bridge pickup. <laughs> Now let's hear the bridge and the humbucker together. And finally, let's hear the Seymour Duncan Antiquity humbucker at the neck. Mm -hmm. 